Yeah, okay, now that I collected my thoughts. <laughs> um, so basically, the biggest opponent is you. you. You need to get over the hurdle of, you know, yourself really so um what i always did was you know you want to prepare as much as you can for this interview but don't over prepare because the last thing you want is to be sounding like a robot that has just memorized answers and responses and everything so what i always tried to do was you know look over um at like so basically my the thing i did was i would make cheat sheets for all like my school so i would literally take a, a sheet of printer paper write out everything that I knew about the school that I found about uh, like found out online questions I want to ask whatever review that the night before but then the day of your interview don't look at it at all you know you already prepared you know you did what you had to do um really it comes down to just having a conversation they just want to see that you have substance and that you say who you are who you say you are right so um like what I did was I would call my friends I would just hang out with my dogs <laughs> like I would just like literally chill, do nothing, put on my suit like 20 minutes before my, I mean, I'm a guy, so I don't need makeup or all that, but just put on your suit like 20 minutes before your interview and kind of just, you know, take your chill pill and just relax because the last thing you want is for like you to be all shaky and, and like freaking out over something that is entirely in your control, at least at the very beginning. Um, and then if anything ever technical happens during your interview, let's say you get kicked out or you're waiting in the waiting room for 40 minutes and they're not letting you in or whatever happens, just know that they are doing their best on their end to like get everyone in, do their identification process if there is one. Um, so just know that like th they're working on things and that if there is some sort of issue, it really, it will not affect you in any way because they know that everyone else is having these issues as well. Um, because you know, everyone's internet goes out, everyone has their bad times with Zoom. Um, so it's kind of inevitable to experience things like that, but you just need to remind yourself that, you know, just stay as calm as you possibly can because um, th that can end up hindering your performance or anything, like if you're too stressed out. Um, so just, like I said, relax, you know, say your mantra if you have one, you have a quote, whatever, say that over and over again, pet your dogs, play with your toy thing or whatever you, you have. So just like keep calm, cool and collected. I loved all these, these are spectacular. Brandon, the comfort zone, it's always a sweet spot. Brandy, I mean, using affirmations the night before tests, say I'm gonna get 99, I've used those before it worked. Sonia, the the playlist to listen to, I've done that too. I, I wish I was able to do all those things um, before an oral surgery uh, interview last year. My roommates maybe shovel the snow out of the driveway. <laughs> but yeah, these are these are all great. It's such a great night, guys. Thank you so much for joining us. And thank you for everyone putting on this event with us. We really, we're happy to have you here. Thank you.